What's up everybody, this is Bolo, and in today's video, we'll be covering three of the basic mining methods covered on the Minecraft official wiki, as they name them on the wiki. This is the basic three space branch mine, the more compact version of the three space branch mine, and the five space branch mine. So they're referring to the number of spaces between each horizontal branch. We're gonna quickly analyze and check each one of these out. And just from a surface level understanding, just break down which one we think is maybe the best or worst, or if there is too much of a difference. This is the five space branch mine. I suppose the benefit of this branch mine would be that you're covering a larger area quicker, but I, I think that's kind of an illusion that you're actually being more productive. So what I did here is I put simulations of what you might find as far as a diamond vein goes with the blue glass. And if you see the blue glass versus the green glass, and the green glass represents what blocks are exposed as you mine, in none of any of these four branches is that diamond or exposed. And so for that reason, I really don't recommend this method. I mean, it's still a branch mining method, so you'll still find lots of diamonds, but I do think it's inefficient if you're doing multiple branches. This method, in my opinion, is as effective as digging in a straight line. The next method, which I think is actually a really good one, and this is worth doing, the three space mine. One reason that I don't have any concern with these blocks that don't get exposed, because diamond veins, are usually in a too wide formation and so in most cases um, even though there is this totally unexposed portion right here any diamonds will actually be found through the branches so this is a great method better than digging in a straight line if you want to take the time to set it up we have the more compact version of this one. This, in my opinion, is the best method. If you look, everything around and in between all four of these branches is exposed. And there isn't any overlap either. Um, this branch exposes these six, this, these six. So there, it's not wasteful, it's not overexposing any blocks and it exposes everything in the middle. So, um, you'll, you'll find any diamonds that are between any four of these. This is a really great way to kind of approach mining the majority of a chunk. So it covers eight layers. So if you're mining on layer 10, that's layers 10 through 16, which is where most of the diamonds are. And you'll actually hit most of them in most of the chunks that you you end up going through. Anyway, guys, out of these three methods that we found on the wiki, I definitely recommend the more compact version of the three space branch mine. Uh, if you enjoy these videos, um, please leave a like. Please comment below if there's a mining method you want me to analyze and check out. But I'll be doing more of these hopefully in the future. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.